morning everyone. I hope y'all having a beautiful and gorgeous morning. Um in the room getting ready for my IUI to be done. I'm super excited. Yes, super excited. <laughs> And hopefully they let me record it. Hopefully. I hope they do. Let me record it. Jesus is on the main line. Tell him what you want. Jesus is on the main line. Tell him what you want. You should come up and tell him what you want. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. You making it possible for me to get this done. Thank you, Jesus, for whatever and everything you do for me and my family on a daily basis. I thank you, Jesus. Because without you, I don't know where I'll be. I know where I'll be. You is my everything, Jesus. Just trying to conceive this TT journey been a long journey for me. Yes, it has. First, I got my tubes on tie. They told me try natural on my own. I tried. Didn't work out. Then I realized someone was having a problem, and that's why I wasn't conceiving. So then. My doctor didn't even tell me nothing about the IUI. I researched about the IUI on my own. I found out, so I gave them a call and said, hey, I want the IUI. And they said, well, just call us when you for your next menstrual cycle and come in. So for four days straight, I did blood work, Monday through Thursday, blood work and ultrasound. So today is the big day, my IUI. So happy I get it done and over with. Yes. Yes. 
So I have my pregnancy test done. Do my pregnancy do my pregnancy test October the twentieth. Happy yes. Yes. All I can say is thank you, Jesus. Because you know I've been through the storm, Jesus. And you heal me, and you're still healing me every day. People will say, well, how she could do this? How could she could do that when she lost two kids? But you made a way possible for me to get through this terrible storm I went through, Jesus. It was you. Make sure I have a smile on my face every day. Make sure I could get the get the kids together every day for school and everything. Make sure I get up, cook them dinner, wash their clothes, see about their everyday needs and my everyday needs, Father. I just want to say thank you for everything you do for me. Appreciate it and acknowledge you in every way I can, Father. I am your child, Father. It was days I was so stressed out, I didn't want to get out of my bed, but you made it possible. You helped me get out of that bed and say, hey, don't be stressed out. Get up. Get out of that bed and smile. Comb your hair, get dressed. Go for a while. Go sit on your porch. Go watch your nice movie. Get up. I know my kids don't want me to be depressed or stressed. They want to be me. They want me to be happy and go on with my life. Cause they know I will always love them. They always they both hold a special place in my heart. And I would never replace them. I have to move forward and this is what I'm doing. Oh, none but relaxing. Oh, nice. <laughs> Is he working? Yes. Yeah. So that's enough for the um, the sample. Is enough. It's a little bit lower than what we would like, um, but that's why we're combining the two, and that's why we also encourage you to um, have intercourse tonight and tomorrow. Oh, okay. Those stirrups are out if you want to put your feet up there, whatever you're comfortable with. We're just going to draw all that up. You can scoot your bottom all the way down to the end of the bed. Okay. You're almost going to feel like your bottom's hanging off. What I do is I just make sure this is nice and tight so we're not sucking up air, mm -hmm. and then this is the cover so that mm -hmm. part just pulls off. 